the Southern Treasury on the Silk Road. Durban 2040 is an eternal prosperity source. The time arrow rushes through the millennia into the future. The ancient fortress sparks off the first lights in micro-museums and workshops, descends along the shady boulevard and the railway, disperses along a white waterfront promenade. The local initiatives, set out back in 2020, become independent institutions, provide profit and turn into city centers. The extension of the existing city of Derbent forms two wings, the Oasis City to the north, with an innovative agropark and orchards, and the Craftsman City to the south, with a light industry center. From the mountains to the sea, there are natural corridors. The urban garden's mosaic is connected by green streets. Quarries are turned into eco-parks, and the Samordor Bend Canal near the mountains becomes a linear park collecting water for residents. Electric buses and a city electric train connect all city areas, whilst two loops starting from the Underbridge Central Transport Hub complete the transport network. A developed pedestrian and cycle network and a barrier-free environment encourage alternative, healthy mobility, providing everyone in the city with absolute freedom to be wherever they want. An express train is launched from Mahachkala Airport, their cruise and yacht ports, as well as a small aircraft field. Durban reinstates its status as a gateway on the Silk Road again. The renewed city regains its splendor. Like in ancient times, it is open to the whole world once more. Here, the historical spirit is preserved in every stone and every grain of sand, in every house and yard and intertwine Miguel's streets in memories and rituals. Durbent is a city between the Caspian and the Caucasus. A cable car leads up to the mountains, a few minutes journey, and you find yourself in a dense relict forest, a mountain winery, or an ancient fort. Durbent faces the sea with a passenger port to the south. The famous historic center adjoins areas of creative industries, a business cluster, recreation, and entertainment. It is woven organically into the lively urban fabric. The northern embankment completes the coastline. From the programmatically rich park to the yacht club's marina, the cultural landscape concedes to more natural forms, creating a microclimate protected from winds and waves. With either small, careful steps or bold, ambitious projects, through its flexible strategy, Durban approaches its dream. This is the city of the wise and courageous ones. The ones who honor traditions and cultivate their future. <laughs>